guys welcome back to the channel so if you didn't know i'm josie and we are here at the chicken coop or the chicken tractor whatever you would like to call it and we are about to try to start finishing a little bit of the stuff for it so we are going to start with the door um right this second we're gonna put a door in the front here so that we can get in and out easier and we can go ahead and finish and um because right now we're just leaving it kind of open and I don't want predators getting in there or anything like that. So we are about to start doing that now. But so far, the chicken tractor has worked really well for us. We have no complaints with it whatsoever. Um, it is a little heavy, but we just need to put a little bit better stuff on it for the four-wheeler like we said we were going to do. But just haven't been able to yet. Um, but soon we will. Um, hopefully maybe this weekend we will do that. Um, but yeah, just come along with us. That's wrong. The wood's not square. You know how bad it bothers me. Oh. Okay. Oh, yeah. Here's the one square wood. Move now. Go. Go. Can you hold up on that side? Mm hmm Mark it with this. Looks good to me. Love you, be careful. The heavy bobs? Barely sticks out. Okay, let's go put this on the trucker. As you can see, it's coming together. It's just going to be a little door, but it's plenty for us. What's wrong? 
So now we are trying to build the door, the actual door that will swing. What size do we need it to be? 19 and 3 eighths. So we're about to cut it right now and then put that up as well. For the top piece too. Mm -hmm. That looks like crap. It's okay. Perfecto. How you like that saw? Nice job, man. Forty-seven and a half, so we need to cut it at forty. No, forty-eight and a half. Sorry. So if we cut it at forty-eight and a eighth, that gives us a little bit of gap on top and bottom. So it doesn't drag. Awesome. If we do it, we don't have enough wood to do it the other way. So we only got one piece of wood left. Okay, this, of that one. Yeah, I think it'll be fine. Kind of straight. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> yeah, it's a little over 96. We can go 48 and a. We can probably do 48 and a. 96 and a quarter, so we can go 48 and 8. Okay. It worked out perfect. Ain't it funny how God works? Yeah. Okay, so now we have the door done. Now we just gotta put it on up. Right? Yeah. Right. So now we are about to put the hinges on and the door handle and then we will be done. Um, it fits, so that's good. It's not perfectly square, but it works for what we need it to, to be used for. He's going to go get the bit, like the regular Phillips bit for the screws for the hinges. And while he's doing that, since it's getting dark or trying to get dark, I'm going ahead and going over here to the shed and getting the staple gun so that we can also attach the chicken wire so that um they can be secure for the night and i think that's all we still need to extend it which of course we're not going to get to that tonight we need to extend it and then we also need to um see if I can find this right we are going to extend it and then we also need to like to extend the coop part so they can have a little bit more room up there and then we also Need to just add something to it so we can move it around a little bit better and then it will be good to go. I think eventually down the line I might put some tin on top of it so we don't have to have that tarp. But right now we're just going to have it like this until we get to that point maybe for the fall or something like that we might do that. Um, but yeah.
So of course, anytime we are trying to do anything on the property, it's after we get back home from work and eat and stuff like that. So then it gets dark pretty early. So we um, got this finished, the door part that we were wanting to do, which was a good job. Um, it looks really good. We just need a latch for it to keep it closed because it won't stay closed right now. Um, but let me try to show you without get them getting out. Okay, so here is the door. You can see. And um, it does swing open. And so I just don't want to let them out right now. Um, and then it does have the chicken wire all around it, um, which looks really good. I'm really proud of us and the husband for doing it and finally getting it done. Now we just need to finish the coop part so they can have a little bit more space up in there. And then also we need to, what else? Um, oh, add something to make it help carry it easy, easier instead of, um, I know you can't see me, but instead of, you know, have, us having to push it, we can just put it on the four-wheeler. But that is it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this little video. It wasn't very informative just because we didn't know what we were doing. Um, but I hope you like this video and you subscribe to the channel and we will see you next time.